Welcome to the endoscopic linear cutting stapler and reload instruction for use video by Magimar Medical Products. Remove the reload out of the package in its open position. Do not remove the shipping wedge until the reload is loaded into the stapler. Ensure that the stapler's black return knobs are completely pulled back and the articulating lever is in the neutral position. To load the stapler with the reload, insert the pin located at the distal end of the stapler shaft into the reload. Ensure that the load alignment indicator on the reload aligns with the load alignment indicator on the stapler shaft. Push the reload downwards and turn 45 degrees clockwise relative to the stapler so that the reload will be locked into position. At this point, the alignment indicators will realign. Then, remove the shipping wedge from the reload and squeeze the handle once to close the jaws of the device. To unload the reload from the stapler, make sure the articulating lever is in the neutral position and open the jaws completely by pulling back the black return knobs. Pull the unload slash unlock button and turn the reload 45 degrees counterclockwise. Then remove the reload from the stapler. After closing the jaws completely by squeezing the handle once, insert the device into the body cavity through an appropriately sized choker canola. Once inside the body cavity, pull back the black return knobs completely to open the jaws. Apply the device across the tissue that will be transected. Squeeze the handle completely to close the jaws across the tissue, and wait for 15 seconds before firing. The jaws can be opened and repositioned by pulling back the black return knobs completely. The device is equipped with a safety interlock that will not fire the staples and cut tissue until the green button is pushed. To fire the device, push the safety green button, then squeeze the handle repetitively until it locks. The total number of squeezes is relative to the length of the reload. Once the firing is completed, pull back the black return knobs completely to open the jaws. Remove the device from the tissue gently, check the site of the application for hemostasis after the removal of the device. Close the jaws by squeezing the handle, then remove the device from the body cavity. Unload the reload from the stapler.